Ah, yes, yes. So, you may have noticed, we just got back from watching uh, Birth of the Dragon. Bruce Lee, uh, loosely based, inspired film. Uh, this is going to be a quick review. Uh, we're going to do another one after this. It's going to be more in depth. Uh, so we're going to keep this one a little short. So, start off with Ian. What did you think? Uh, it was not too, it's okay. It wasn't like the greatest martial arts movie I've ever seen or anything like that. It's just, eh, if you kind of have nothing else to really watch and you really want to go to the movie theater, <laughs> then I guess you can go see this. But I mean, it's not really like, oh my goodness, I was blown away by the story or the action. It was just, eh, for the most part. Yeah, so I'm like a huge, huge Bruce Lee fan. Uh, I did martial arts growing up, so... I, I was kind of expecting a <laughs> lot from the film, uh, but I was, I kind of got a, a different different film. So we got we got story and we got some fighting. I wanted story <laughs> and fighting. <laughs> so um, uh, I, I kind of have to agree. I, I would say as of right now, if there's other movies you haven't seen that are considered um, you know big blockbusters of the summer, I would definitely say check those out yeah. first. Um, if you are a Bruce Lee fan like myself. Uh, it's, it's worth a watch. A um, little bit of conflicting info uh, goes on in there. I mean, I don't know 100% the story of how the fight really went down. This kind of is loosely based off of some uh, given accounts. So um, overall, uh, five star rating, of course. You know, one lowest, five the highest. What would you give it? Two. Two. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, Ian is a co. <laughs> Dang. Okay. It's like two, two, huh? I mean, it's not like amazing. Like it's, I can miss it. Like okay, if, if I can so like miss if, you, if you've never watched this film, you'd be okay. Yeah, like, like, I, like oh, if I missed the film, I like I don't feel like I missed anything. Okay, okay. So it's was a two. It's not like oh, so I had to see I, it. I'm gonna give it at least a three. I don't think it was that bad. Like <laughs> I, it had, it had. It I had, didn't say it was bad. You gave it a two. Two, a two is bad. Two is like below <clears throat> average. I mean, this, this, it's at least arch, average. For Mars Arch movie, I'm expecting at least like cool. I mean, for for what they're doing, Bruce Lee. I'd I'd say it's at least average. Uh, I'm gonna give it a three. So I, I guess <laughs> so I guess combined, it's about two, two and a half. Five. I almost um, gave it two and a half. But. I, I, I would say it's a three star. Um, there are some decent fight scenes at the end. Yeah. There's there's not a whole lot of martial arts in the very beginning because they're working up to that. Um, so yeah, so so three star. So if uh, you are a Bruce Lee fan, uh, you know AI reviews says go check it out. Uh, if not, stay home and get ready for the weekend because there's Game of Thrones, Rick and Morty, and yeah. Ballers. And you got the McGregor fight. Yeah, yeah, so so action packed weekend pretty much, yes. right? So um, this one not as action packed as the weekend, but um, you know, like I said, if you are a Bruce Lee fan, check it out. Mm-hmm. If not, eh. right? <laughs> you can sleep on it. Yes. So uh, that's about it. That's uh, it. We're gonna have our longer review coming up on our next video. So if you do want a more in depth video, a little bit more, and you know, it is gonna be. Uh, Filled with some spoilers. Yes. This is spoiler free, so if you do want to see spoilers, the next longer video is going to have that. Um, so once again, don't forget to subscribe, comment, like the video. Uh, yeah. Also, uh, don't forget, right? If you feel the need, yeah. or just you know, poof, you get possessed and like, I need to share this. Someone else needs to see this. Everybody needs to see this. Please feel free to share. Uh, thanks for watching. Peace. Peace.